Do you hear my voice now? Yes. Ah, okay, okay. So, hi, how are you today? I'm good. Okay, how was、uh, Chuseok holiday? How was it? It, it was good time. Okay, okay, it was a good time then. Fine. And uh, did you go somewhere this Chuseok? Yes, I went to my. Grandparents' house. Oh, you went to your grandparents' house. Okay,、mm -hmm. then、uh, how long did it take to go there? Um, it takes five hours. Five five hours. You mean it took five hours for you and your family members to go to your grandparents' house? Am I right? Yes. Ah,、uh, okay. I see. It's a、uh, it's a really long time. All right then. What about coming back then? How long did it take when you come back? Came back when you came back from your grandparents' house? How long did it take? Hmm. It take. Oh, it, it took. took. Uh huh. Um. It took. Uh huh. Four hours. Ah,、uh, it took four hours, which means total going to your grandparents' house and coming back from your grandparents' house. It took nine hours total. Okay, that's really long time. And ah,、uh, who went to ah、uh, who went to your grandmother ah、uh, grandparents' house with you? Who?、Mm. I went to my grandparents' house with、um, my fam family. Aha,、uh -huh. your family members. Okay, that's good. That's good. And all right, did you see your cousins? Yes, I saw my cousins. Ah,、uh -huh, I see. Okay, how many cousins did you see? Um, I saw um four cousins. Ah,、uh, you saw four cousins. Okay. Oh, just only four cousins. Like, okay, how many siblings do you have? I don't know. Ah,、uh, you don't know siblings. Okay, okay. I'll teach you. Don't worry. Sibling. Okay. I think I was. Yeah, I I think I was doing this. Your homework and uh. I'll add it here. Okay. Sibling. Hmm. Wait. Siblings. 
siblings, siblings, siblings. That is siblings. So when I ask you how many siblings do you have, how would you answer this question? I have mm -hmm. three siblings. Aha. Uh -huh. And including you, there are four uh, four daughters in your family. Am I right? Yes. Aha. Uh -huh. Then what about your cousins that you saw this time? Four cousins. And what about them then? Are they all uh, girls or boys? Some boys are there too? They, they're um, only girls. <laughs> really? So like eight of you, you guys are all girls. Yes. Okay. Oh, that's interesting. That's really interesting. Oh, then next question is, I know you have grandparents and do they have a, do they have grandson? Not granddaughter. Does do they have grandson? Yes, they didn't have grandson. They don't have grandson. Okay, okay, okay. That's interesting because you know, like, what are the odds? Like eight children, but then there's no son. Okay, that's interesting. But I, 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 I personally think that uh, daughters are easier to take care of. So I think maybe it's better. Okay, good. How many days did you stay there in your grandparents' house? Um, I... I was I stayed my grandparents house mm -hmm. um, five days oh five days but this should be for five days so you said I stayed my grandparents house five days okay that shows a few things here i can uh, tell you what those are wait a second let me just uh, make it bigger okay okay here you said i stayed my grandparents house five days and that indicates that one ava doesn't know stay the verb stay is intransitive verb and the second thing is Eva doesn't know uh, she needed she needs to use a preposition the preposition here okay it shows just uh, two things to me at least okay so which means first you need to learn to understand the verb stay so what about stay what does that mean what is stay that's right but now this is the real question stay you said stay stay Okay, so 
Can you make a sentence with stay? Okay, you said, mm -hmm. I stayed my grandparents' house. And what is that in Korean? I stayed my grandparents' house. Okay. No, actually, you're wrong. This is what you said. 나는 내 조부모님 댁 머물렀다. It's because stay doesn't have where. 어디 어디에. It doesn't have it. It's not this. No, it's just this. That's why you need to use some kind of preposition. Then now, what you want is... What is this preposition? Oh, right. That's right. But there are many different types of 전치사. And to be specific, when you want to say this way, which one of those do you need? Which one of those do you need? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's right. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. So now it's your turn to change the sentence. I stayed in my grandparents' house, but can you change it? I stayed at my grandparents' house. That's right. Beautiful. That's how you do. Very good. I stayed at my grandparents' house. I stayed at my grandparents' house. Okay. And next is this. And now the next thing is this. Well, okay, now you need to add some more things there to make sense. How would you do it? I stayed at my grandparents' house and... Five days. That's correct. But just now you said, I stayed my grandparents' house five days, which means you didn't use the preposition. Then now you tell me, what's for? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And what else? It has some other things too here. I think maybe you need to at least tell me one more. That's right. Okay. So you're right. I stayed at my grandparents' house for five days. I stayed at my grandparents' house for five days. I stayed at my grandparents' house for five days. Okay. That's how you learn. And now... Four. Four. Okay, okay. Well, uh, oh, oh, wait, 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 what happened? How come it's not disappearing? Ah, it's okay. I think you understand four. Okay, so you stayed 
at your grandparents' house for five days, and what did you do there with your sisters and your cousins? Oh, by the way, are you the are you the are are you the oldest one among eight uh eight girls? Are you the oldest one? I don't understand. Aha, uh -huh, I see. Okay. So what I'm saying is Okay. So my question is Are you the oldest one among the girls? That was my question, and do you still not understand? Yes, I am the um, oldest. Mm -hmm. um, among the First. Okay. That way you want to say oldest one. And I think you don't understand this one. And I'll teach you. Don't worry. I am the oldest one among the girls. I am the oldest one among the girls. Okay. That's the thing. So now one. Oh, what's going on? Why is it not deleting here? You know what? Let me just uh, open again. I'm scared. Okay, what's happening? Oh yeah, it's working perfectly. I guess it's fine. Okay, now you need to understand what is one. 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 Okay, what is one? Mm -hmm. Yeah, right. As a starter, this is just one, just like you said. And second is one can be some kind of pronoun for a thing and the last is that is one that's how you use one so what if i say okay uh what if i say huh, i am the tallest one i am the tallest one I am the tallest one. What does that mean? I am the tallest one. Hmm. Right. That's I'm the tallest one. And what about this is the most expensive? This is the most expensive one. This is the most expensive one. What does that mean? Hmm. This is.
한짱 비싼 것이다. 음. Okay, right, perfect. Then now I make a question. Uh, which is the most expensive one among these? Which is the most expensive one among these? Which is the most expensive one among these? Either Jungae. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But what is more like what? But which is more like Otan God? So I'll just change just a little thing there. Uh, okay, great. That's how we do. So my question originally was uh were you the okay are you the are you the oldest one among all the girls or the girls okay now do you understand this one yes good like same as person same thing okay okay i see then what did you do there you eight girls gathered in grandparents house for five days and what did you do for fun there um, we, um, We went mm. We went Hadamsu. Hadamsu? What is Hadamsu? Hadamsu. Oh, okay. Uh, is, is, is the, okay. Uh, explain, please. I don't know what I'm su or su. So what is it? Um, there are uh, small mountains. Aha. So this is forest. 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 Are you talking about forest? Yes. Aha. Okay. Okay. So actually you went to Hadam forest. Okay. How was it? Mm. It was very beautiful. Oh, okay, I see. Oh, and it's it says that they have some kind of monorail monorail here. Did you know that? Yes. Uh-huh. Okay. So uh did you try this? Did you try this monorail? All right, it's fine. But today, actually, I want to do something with you. And that is, I need to make sure you know the words that you learned so far. So let's go by uh, every 30. So from, okay. Uh, now I give you one word here, from. And uh, can you make a sentence with it? Any sentence is fine. Make it. From. Mm. 
Okay, from make a sentence, please. She is from Korea. Okay. And meaning? She is from Korea. She is from Korea. And meaning? Mm -hmm. Okay, good enough. And next is 60. Oh, yeah. One. Make a sentence with one, please. Mm. It, it is mm. oh, almost too heavy. Okay. One. Okay. Uh, books. One and then what would you say? The book. The book. You mean this? It is the most happy one, the book? Books. Books. Oh no, you can't make it. The first problem, I'll just explain everything here. So from the first problem here, I'll say, uh, this is what you said here. Okay. This and you said, uh, there are two different uh, two problems here. What yeah. is, uh, okay, um, comparative. Yeah. That's one, and the other one is. Oh. I'll solve them both. Don't worry about it. Okay, so the answer is it is the most, I mean, we don't say most, it's just a uh, it is the, you know what, I'll do it. Uh, heavy. What is heavy in Korean? Very good. Then what about this? How'd you make it? Oh no, that is adverb. You know what? So I'll explain. Now you don't know this heavy thing. Okay, what is heavy as a part of speech? And as a part of speech, what is it? That's right. So I'll say A here. A for adjective. And now, you just said heavily. Now, what is heavily? What do you think it is? Uh, the meaning first, please. What is the meaning of it? Mm -hmm. No. It's 
this? And what is it as a part of speech? Mm. You need to understand this part. All right, good. So I'll just put it here, A, B, B. And thus, this will be A, D, J. So they are different. Okay. And now you need to tell me, what about comparative? That should be this. How to make this in English? Heavier. Oh yeah, good. Heavier. Now you tell me, what about this then? This is superlative. In Korean, this is called 최상급. How'd you make it? Oh, yes, but don't forget about this. The you need to always say the heaviest. Okay, that's good. You did it. So it seems like they can change this way. Can I do it too? Oh, okay. It's not only one sided, and also this one is not only one sided, but then you can just uh, freely change it like this. Just as you wish. And now, uh, then I give you another one. That will be, what about this? And this is an uh, adjective. And what's the meaning of beautiful? Um, um... Okay. And what about the comparative? How do you make the comparative? More beautiful. Mm -hmm. uh, more beautiful. And of course, this is adjective, but I wouldn't use it. I mean, I wouldn't write it down. And now you tell me, what's the third thing? The superlative. What is the superlative of more beautiful? Most beautiful. No, you need to understand. You need to say the when you say superlative. So could you do it again? The most beautiful. Okay. All right, you're here, and now you need to understand why. And next question is, why is it heavy plus ER, heavy plus EST, but this one beautiful is more, and why this beautiful is most? What's the difference between those two words here? Can you tell me? Mm. 
well, I can tell you. Uh, 형사가 이름절일 때, 이, 어, 형용사가 이음절이고, y로 끝날 때. 뭘 대신 단어 뒤에서 뒤에 er을 붙여준다. That's the rule. 그래서 why you have this and this. And now it's the same thing, but slightly different, of course. 오케이. Okay. That's why it worked just like this. That's the difference. Syllables. That's all it takes. 오케이. Okay. Then what about this? Can you make beautiful uh adverb? Can you do that? 왜 이거 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 Beauty. What was that? I, I didn't hear you. I'm sorry. Beauty. No, it's not. It's always L-Y, like the most of cases. So that way, this is a beautiful plus L-Y. It would be beautifully. So you can understand the length of the word, like long or short, it doesn't affect from the uh, like uh, adjective to what is it, adverb transition. It doesn't affect that at all. So this is what you want to understand. And let me just uh, quickly try this. Can I send it like this? Can I, or can I not? Or oh, maybe I can't. Okay, wait. Mm. Okay, and I guess I'll just take a picture of it and then send it to you. Okay. Yep. Yeah. That's how it works. Then now back to the uh, Anki question. Where were we? So now we say heavy and what's the what's the comparative of heavy? Heavier. That's right. And what about the superlative? Heaviest. Ah. Uh -uh, no. I told you twice. Say again. The heaviest. That's right. The heaviest. 
the heaviest. Heavy, heavier, the heaviest. Heavy, heavier, the heaviest. Okay, that's done. And next is where were we? Oh yeah, number sixty. And we should move all the way here. Oh yeah, you said this. And now you need to change it. How would you make it? It is the most heavy one, the books. So can you change this sentence? It is. Mm -hmm. The heaviest. Mm -hmm. Good. One. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. All right. All right. I'll just uh, put it here and then I'll say, uh, mm. and what does that mean? What is this in Korean? It is the happiest one, the books. What do you mean? Uh -huh. Okay, now I see what you don't know and I'll solve this problem. Wait. Okay. next is this all right uh i'll just make some more sentences here uh oh, one of the no no there are two things one is That is one, and the other is that is another one. I mean, the other one. And so you need to understand this. Okay. So let's say this is uh, sentence number one and sentence number two. How to make them? You need to show me how you make it, and I will. Show you the way. Okay, how do you make the first sentence? I am. I am. So definitely you don't know this, and that is, I am one of smart students. This is one, and the second one is, you need to know it. Okay, and this one, can you do it? I uh -huh. am the smart smartest very good one of the students i see i see your problem 
Here you need to say, I am the smartest student among all the students. Okay. It's the same, but I'll just add all the students. Okay, so there are two different ways to say it. I mean, two, these are two different sentences, but they look quite similar. That's the problem. Uh, students can't learn this. Okay, one is, um, 많은 사람들 중에 걔네랑 나랑 동급인 거예요. 같다라는 거예요. 하나는. 그래서 이걸 나눠야 될것 같은데, 나눠서 얘기를 해줄게요. 그러면은. 이걸 나눠서 얘기를 합시다. 그게 아마 이해하기 편할 거라서. 자, 이거를 나눠서 설명을 해주고, 설명 여기다 남겨줄 테니까. 계속 보면서 배웠으면 좋겠어요, 제대로. 1번과 2번이 달라요. 왜 다른지를 설명을 해줄 건데, 1번 같은 경우에는 나와 같은 어, 여러 명이 나와 같다는 이야기. 이게 1번이다. 근데 2번은 여러 명이 있고 나는 그들과 다르다는 이야기. 이게 다른 거예요. 이해됐습니까? 이게 다르다는 거? 네. 오케이, 좋습니다. 그렇게 해서 이게 달라요. 이렇게 됩니다. 그래서 이렇게 될 때는 얘네가 뭐랑 같이 쓰인다라고 하면은 오케이, 도식이 좀 꼬였는데 그냥 괜찮아. 이렇게 하면 되겠다. 이때는 어, 뭘쓸 것이냐? One of 명사예요. 저 N은 이거예요. 이게 사용되는 방법입니다. 뭐 중에 하나 이렇게. 그 다음에 뒤에 거, 두 번째 거는 음... 최상급에다가 어몽 명사 S 이렇게 되겠죠? 이렇게 되는 거예요. 약간 다른 겁니다. 그래서 이거는 이제 정리를 해주자면 은 one of many 그 다음에 the best 최상급 among 이두 개가 다르다는 거 여기다 설명을 해줬어요. 이렇게 그렇다면 우리는 이걸 문장으로 조금 만들어 볼 텐데 갖고 놀줄 알아야 됩니다. 자 그러면은 어, 자 이거부터 만들어 볼게요. 나는 똑똑한 학생들 중한 명이다. 어. I am. 음. one of oh. smart students. 응. Mm. I'm one of smart students. 이렇게 되고 더가 들어가도 되고요. 근데 더가 들어가는 게 일반적이니까 그렇게 할게. 원 오브 더가 많이 쓰입니다. I am one of the smart students. I am one of the smart students. 굳이 한국어로는 더를 해석을 안 하는데 그 학생들 중에 어, 그 똑똑한 학생들 중에 나도 껴 있다 이 얘기예요. 이게 one of예요. 그럼 얘는 뭐예요? 나는 그 학생들 중 가장 똑똑하다. 이거 할수 있습니까? I'm the smartest among the students. Okay. I'm the smartest among the students. I'm the smartest among the students.
Okay. All right. Then now, uh, The um, my friend. I am the tallest among my friends. I am the tallest among my friends. I am the tallest among my friends. 여기에서 명사, 이 형용사가 꾸며줄 명사로 person이나 one 같은 거 넣어도 되고 안 넣어도 돼요. 왜냐하면 더랑 형용사가 같이 써져 있으면 뭐뭐 한 자라는 말도 같기 때문에 내가 내 친구들 중 가장 큰 사람이다 라는 말이 그냥 축약돼서 들어갔다고 보면 돼요. 저것도 괜찮습니다. 오케이. Okay, um... Okay, what can I say? Um, hmm. Hmm, you're going to And what about 60 and 90? Oh, okay. Oh, you need to see this one. Okay, so where did it go? 이거, 이 문장 살짝 틀렸거든요. 맞게 고칠 수 있어요? 음, it is the heaviest. 음. Among the books. 되죠. 어, 됩니다. 이렇게 고쳐서 가는 거예요. 조금씩 정확히 뭐가 해결되고 있냐면은 여기에서 비교급이랑 이런 걸 몰라요. 그 다음에 원오브랑 이거 사용법을 모르는 거예요. 원오브랑 더 최상급 이걸 모르는 거예요. 그냥 더 플러스 최상급에다가 어머 이걸 몰랐던 거예요. 그럼 이걸 알게 만들면 됩니다. 오케이 그렇게 해서 결과물이 쭉쭉 내려와서 이렇게 나온다. 오케이. 또 90번으로 갑니다. 90번으로 가면 무슨 문장이 나올까? To. To는 너무 쉽다. Use. Use를 이용해서 문장 하나만 만들어 보세요. 이 use it the computer 뭐라고 했죠? 다시 한번 해줄래요? in 뭐라고요? she use it the computer she used the computer okay that's possible good she used the computer Okay. And now 90 and we will go to 120. On. Make a sentence with on. O N on the preposition. Uh, 
Stockholm is on the table. Okay. And 150, that is out. Make a sentence with out. She 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 was uh huh. Out the game. She was out the game. Okay, that one yeah. indicates something. You said she was out the game. She was out the game. Okay, what are you trying to say with it? What is it in Korean then? Mm -hmm. Uh -huh. Okay, out. Uh, what do you think out means? What What is this out in Korean? What What does that mean? Mm -hmm. We don't really use this out as a verb, but out is more like no. Okay. I just need to teach you this. Mm. This one is get out of. That is uh, 어디에서 나가다. Mm. 왜냐면은 누가 나간다고 할때꼭 물어보아지는 게 있잖아요. 어디에서 나갔다는 얘기야? 라는 게 궁금하잖아요. 그래서 그걸 한꺼번에 외워서 묶어서 외우는 게 get out of 예요. 그래서 어. <웃음> 자, 문장 저거 고쳐서 한번 만들어 볼까요? 그럼 이번에 다시 어떻게 하면은 문장이 제대로 나올 수 있을까요? 이 문장에는 시, 지금 현재 동사가 있는데 동사는 지금 뭐하세요? 비동사예요. 근데 그렇게는 안 써요. 잘. 그리고 그렇게 쓰려면 여기에 전치사 오브가 들어가긴 해야 돼요. 근데 그럼에도 달, 불구하고 뜻이 달라져요. 그래서 뭐뭐에서 나갔다라는 걸 이제 아니까 그거 가지고 문장 한번 만들어 볼수 있을까요? 네. He got out of the game. Perfect. Yeah. She got out of the game이 돼야 됩니다. 그런 식으로 하나씩 배우는 거예요. 없는 거예요. 지금 현재 머리에. 괜찮습니다. 잡아 나가면 되니까. She got out of the game. She got out of the game. 음, 이런 식으로. Get out of를 없었으니까 어쩔 수 없었죠. 자. 오케이 okay, 그 다음에 180 180 we go at 180 and that is so s o so can you make a sentence with it so
Y God, uh, it can, uh, if so, so, uh huh, so he. So he, he He was surprised. Okay, so as a conjunction, okay, good. 180, then 210 is game. Make a sentence with game. Ah, 잠깐만 여기까지 하고요. 일단 뭐좀 물어볼게요. 지금 그 숙제 제출하는 거를 영상으로 찍어서 제출하진 않고 있잖아요. 그거 언제부터 중단한 거죠? 왜 중단하게 됐을까요? 저희 왜 중단했죠? 음, 모르겠어. 그죠? 선생님이 중단하라고 한것 같진 않은데 왜 그러냐면 영작 숙제를 해서 보내는데 그 영작 숙제가 실제로 본인이 어떻게 만들어서 보내고 있는지를 제가 알 길이 없어요 그거를 그냥 본인 실력이 아닌 상태에서 긁어서 어디서 긁어서 이렇게 갖다가 쓴다거나 이러면 은 그게 더 문제거든요 틀리면 은 차라리 내가 안키로 만들어주는데 안 틀리고 그거를 만약에 자기 실력이 아닌 거를 만약 그렇게 만들어버리면 은 근데 그게 맞아버려요 그러면 선생님은 당연히 판단하게 되는 게 어? 아바는 에, 에이바는 이걸 아는구나 그러면 은 내가 이걸 굳이 숙제로 만들어줄 필요는 없겠다 근데 만약에 그게 아니었어요 그러면 은 틀렸을 때는 안키로 들어가기 때문에 본인이 알게 될 텐데 나중에 근데 만약 이게 맞춰버리면 은 본인 실력이 아닌 상태에서 맞춰버리면 그러면 은 그건 되게 큰 문제가 될수 있어요 그래서 그러는 거예요 그렇기 때문에 선생님이 지금 숙제를 영상으로 나온 거를 다 보고 있거든요 비디오 꺼도 돼요. 상관없어요. 비디오에 굳이 본인이 나올 필요는 없습니다. 그냥 끄고 해도 되고 하니까 어차피 그거 뭐줌 들어가서 버튼 한 번, 한두 번만 더 누르면 되는 문제인데 하긴 그러고 나서 유튜브에 또 올리고 하면 귀찮을 수도 있겠다. 근데 그럼에도 불구하고 거기에서 얻어지는 게더 많을 거예요. 나중에. 그리고 숙제를 지금 그거 하는데 얼마나 걸리는지도 내가 알 수가 없어요. 그런 추산 자체가 안 잡히니까 숙제를 뭘더 줘야 될지 덜 줘야 될지 뭘 줘야 될지 이런 걸 모르겠습니다. 그런 복합적인 문제들이 다 같이 오더라고요. 어, 오늘 수업은 여기까지 할 거고 제가 볼때이 어, 부분을 조금 이따가 공유를 해줄 수 있겠네요. 어떤 부분이 어떻게 되고 있는지에 대한. 자, 질문 있습니까? 아니요. 그렇다면 여기까지 하도록 하겠습니다. 수고했습니다